Hello, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are all doing good. Recently, a brand called Beckett Simonon reached out to me and asked me if I would like to try a pair of their shoes. And after doing some research on the brand, I of course said yes. So today, we're taking a look at a pair of loafers by Beckett Simonon. Now before we start, this is my truthful and honest opinion. They are not paying me to say any of this. And quite honestly, they don't even know what I'm going to say. So with that being said, let's get into it. And here we go. It comes in this, of course, shipping box, which I already opened up to take out my personal information. And of course, the shoe box itself. Now I have to say, this shoe box is a lot more heavier duty than something like you would get with a pair of Thorsign shoes or even Stacy Adam shoes. You have the information about the shoes just on the inside of the box. Of course, this book with the information about the brand itself. And of course, the shoes themselves. Now both shoes have their own dust bag, which is very nice to see. You normally see this in very high-end, very expensive shoes. And of course, these are the Cohen black loafers. Very nice. Of course, the inserts. And the other shoe. Now these loafers are made out of full grain calfskin leather. Now you may be asking, what is full grain? Where, if we take a look at this photo from Roman Rearstyre explaining the different layers of leather and leather types. Now a hide has different layers of leather. You have something called genuine leather, top grain leather, and full grain leather. And of course, full grain leather is what these shoes are made out of. It is the higher quality of the three leather types. Now, if we take a look right here, it says fair working conditions. It means that these shoes are not being put together in a sweatshop. The employees are working in a good environment and they're also getting paid a fair wage. Have a very durable rubber heel, Blake stitch construction. On some lower end shoes, you actually see this stitching on the sole. It's actually fake and it's just there for show to make the shoe look more expensive and higher end than it actually is. A lot of the time, those shoes are actually glued together. Here though, it's actually legit Blake stitching construction. They sew it through the sole in through the leather upper and through the inner sole as well. These shoes actually have a leather sole, which means when they wear out, you can actually have them resold, which means you can have these shoes for years and years to come, which is a good thing because all of Becca Simonon designs are classic timeless tires that will not be going out of style anytime soon. Now, if we take a look at the lining of these shoes, I mean, these even have a nice lining. As you can see, this very soft leather with this bit of suede on the back to help you with no slip. And did I mention these shoes also come with a one year warranty? I mean, seriously, how many shoe brands come with a warranty, let alone a one year warranty? which is just another core feature from Beckett Simnon. Now, in closing, I do have to say these shoes feel like a very premium luxury product, but not at a luxury price point. Beckett Simnon is a online store only, which means they have no overhead, no rent to pay on their stores, no middlemen, and also, of course, no inventory to store either. And yes, you heard that correctly. 
Becca Seminon does not have any warehouses for of shoes. These shoes are made when you order them, which actually makes the brand bespoke, which of course is very cool. Now these shoes have a full retail price of $300, but they go on sale for right around $199. And if you consider you are paying Dawson and Murphy prices, but getting Allen Edmonds quality, considering the full grain leather, the Blake stitching construction, and the one year warranty, they truly are not a bad bang per buck. Now, I would really like to see a pair of Dubber Monk Strap wingtips from Beckett Simonon. I really like Dubber Monk Straps and I really like wingtips. Similar to the To Boot New York Dubber Monk Strap wingtips, but those of course have a price point of $400. And also because To Boot New York no longer makes these shoes. Which, of course, is why I would like to see a Beckett Seminon Dubber Muck Strap wingtip because these shoes are very well made, they're at a good price point, and, of course, this is a very premium luxury brand. Now, I haven't had much of a chance to wear these shoes outside because where I live, it's actually snowing, which, of course, means it's more boot season than loafer season. But I do plan on wearing these loafers in the summertime and will keep you guys up to date on how they wear and hold up. And also, I plan on making a video in the future on how to style these Beckett Simonon black loafers, so stay tuned for that. And with that being said, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, tell some friends, share this video, hit that bell icon and notifies you guys when I post new videos, and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.